Hello everyone, this is a quick video on how to fix the original Metro 2033 not starting from Steam. Whether you're interested in comparing it to the Redux version or just for game preservation's sake, uh, you're still going to want to have the game open. Now this is not a fix for the PhysX DLL error. That I will have a video linked in the description that fixes that for you. This is simply the error where you go to Steam, you press play, it says launching, as if it's running and then it just shuts down nothing really happens on your computer it's as if you didn't even play press play now this is a very simple fix thankfully so what you're gonna wanna do is go on to Metro 2033 in your Steam library you're gonna wanna right click go to manage and press browse local files now this is gonna bring up the game folder right here this is what you're gonna see now you're gonna wanna back out of this and go into your common folder and find Metro 2033 now you're going to want to press properties. The size of the game should read, if it's not opening, 4.68 gigabytes or around something like that. So the actual game size is around 7 to 8 gigabytes. You're actually missing around 2.5 to 3 gigabytes of data. Uh, that's why the game is not opening. It's an incomplete download for some reason. This is a very simple fix though. What you're going to want to do is go to properties and then in general, the first thing you see here is go to language and then go and switch this to what worked for me was German. Now what this will do is this will, will prompt Steam to download an update for the game which should be around 2 gigabytes which is that remaining data that we just explained was not there when you originally downloaded the game. So if I press German as you can see it says update queued. If I press update it's going to start to download and as you can see it's around 2 gigabytes which pretty much makes up for the missing space that we were uh, talking about. Sorry about that. Um, so you're just going to want to wait for this to download before that just another thing uh, if the German language option does not prompt Steam to download an update uh, just select any other language try selecting any other language see if that works uh, if not maybe set it back to German and then maybe restart your Steam hopefully that will prompt Steam to download the update for you but for me it just worked by setting it to German and it automatically downloaded everything now once the update is done, you can press play and the game should open as normal. Don't worry, this is not going to change your in-game language to German. Uh, I was a bit concerned about that when I first read this fix. But trust me, it does not change your in-game language. You're going to be uh, playing this in English. So if we press play here, uh, you might get a prompt saying that previous launch was unsuccessful. Would you like to start in safe mode? Just press no. And as you can see, the game opens and you see the intro sequence and everything should be working as normal, which is pretty cool. I do have the Redux version, but I do want to still have the original just to be able to compare it. I actually picked up a physical copy um, just a few weeks ago, shipped all the way from Germany, and it's sitting on my shelf right now, which is really, really cool. So as you can see, the game works fine. I can start a new game. And uh, it's on, I can, I have Ranger Hardcore installed as well, so that is pretty cool. But that's going to be it. Hopefully you found this video helpful and your game now works.